Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. This is OJ here and in this video I'm going to show you three simple ways to reduce the data that Facebook is storing about you. Facebook is increasingly under public scrutiny for compromising its members' data and in the wake of the current growing concern of uh, keeping your data to yourself, I have a couple of quick tips on how to limit the data that is being stored about you on Facebook. The first thing is that Facebook now lets you delete anything from your timeline and it delete it for good. It's not going to store it anymore. This means it will not be able to share it with third parties later on. And to do that, first you can start with your activity log. You can go to the settings at the top right of your screen, then click activity log and you can see everything that you've done in terms of posts, comments, likes, what kind of videos you've watched and liked or saved, anything that you've done, you can see there and you can delete. You can start deleting things that you consider unimportant or there will be many old posts. Sometimes it could be even um, information that you've shared that is no longer relevant. For instance, let's say this is a post that I don't really need on my timeline anymore. It's something that happened a week or two ago. It's old news. It's not relevant. I don't really want it. I will go here and I will delete. Confirm deleting. So you can go through this. The next step would be to go to your settings. You click on that same button. You go down to settings. And here you have a list of settings. On general settings, one of the first things you can do is download a copy of your data. This will be everything that Facebook has stored about you. It will send it to you to your email. So you will click here, you will click on Start My Archive, and here you will need to enter your password. And then you will click on Submit. Here you will just confirm that you want to request your download. And that's that. Okay, the next thing you can do is go to settings again, go to timeline and tagging and select who can be posting on your timeline, who can tag you. In my case, I've restricted it quite a lot. You can see here that I've selected only myself. And the last thing that you can do is go to ads here, your ad preferences. Here is everything that advertisers know about you. So opt out, go through all of these different options and opt out of anything you don't really want to share. For instance, your interests. You can just close topics straight away. Websites that you've visited and uh, groups that you have entered, uh, different uh, interests that you have shared. This is all stored in here. Also, make sure that you scroll through the different tabs because this will have more and more entries that you might want to remove and so on and so forth with the ad settings option you can even control the type of ads that you get targeted with on facebook so you can choose what you allow here what you remove and how much of the information you are actually sharing hide ad topics now here you can actually turn on these filters and they will be blocking this related adverts for instance alcohol or parenting or pets for a period of time in my case i can go with permanently i don't really need alcohol being advertised to me i know what i like right for instance okay and lastly for android mobile users take note Facebook can collect information from your messages and conversations if you're not very careful. So go to settings and find your applications. Then you will go to Facebook, select Facebook and go to permissions. In permissions menu, you will have to turn off SMS and telephone. Make sure that these two are switched off. Okay, so these are my three quick steps on how to limit the data that Facebook is storing about you. I hope this video is helping you and if it does, feel free to click the share button, send it to other people and leave a comment below the video.